Hello, YouTube. I'm back, and that's right. R goes for people. I, I mean, if this would happen. Who wants to know? Ken, what over? What are you talking about? Hey, I'm not a smuggler if that's what you're implying. What business is it of yours? The Abnock is mine now. I'm not giving you drugs, dude. I don't want to get involved in this. I said I don't want to get involved. Yeah, I don't care, buddy. I ain't selling you drugs. Who are you? I'm trying to get into the Sith Academy. Around here they call us hopefuls. Why do you want to get in there? Well, that's the only way to become a Sith, isn't it? In the Academy you learn to use the Force. Why not join the Jedi? After the Sith conquer the galaxy, there aren't going to be any more Jedi, are there? I guess I'd rather join the winning side. What do you think your choices are? I thought they were good, but I've been here for days now, and I haven't drawn any attention at all. I suppose that might be good. I don't know. Some of the attention the Sith have shown to other hopefuls has been pretty deadly. How does someone get into the Academy? <sighs> I wish I knew, to tell you the truth. You have to impress one of the Sith, I guess. Either way, it's Ifura Bon who makes the final decision. She's a Twi'lek Sith Master, I hear. Very high rank. She's the one who decides which hopefuls make it in and which ones don't. Where is this Yathura band? I really couldn't say. I hear that sometimes she comes out into the colony to drink at the cantina, though. But I guess she could be anywhere. I'll be going now. All right. You got anything to say? I've had two friends killed by the Sith already. It must be some kind of test. I'll survive and make it into the academy. I know it. One of Korriban's primary trade routes went through Terrace. Now that it's destroyed, I guess it's you're the Pizak guy. Goodbye. I want to know who you are, though. Sorry, I'm not interested right now. Pilot. You own the Evan Hawk, don't you? Wish I could fly. Greetings, friend. Fellow pilot, are you? Wouldn't mind taking a spin in the Evan Hawk myself. Sleek ship, that one. Doesn't everyone know about the Evan Hawk? In a small colony like this, everyone knows everyone's business. It's better than thinking too much about all the Sith lurking about here. The Hawk's been in and out of here for ages. And out of the way, Starport is a good place for, uh, privateers. Not saying you are one. I'm not a smuggler, if that's what you mean. Wouldn't make any difference to me. Just wish I had a ship like that myself. I Business get that. steady here with the Sith, but it's a boring haul. In case you're forgetting, partner, they don't exactly want us talking about their business. Ah, uh, who cares about them? I've seen some of those things they're digging up in those ruins in the valley. Pretty creepy, if you ask me. 
What have they been digging up? Weird artifacts. Looks like alien stuff. Maybe aliens lived on Coravan a long time ago. Who knows? Don't be stupid. I was talking to one of those Sith, and he said there are tombs there dating back to when the Sith were here in ancient times. There were Sith here in ancient times? Sounds like he was feeding you a line. Korriban's only been settled for a short time. So says you. He said the planet was settled by the Sith a long time ago. And then they all left or something. Those tombs are really important to him. Tombs, eh? That makes the stuff they send us even creepier. Wish I didn't have to haul it around. Where do you take these we things? We used to haul everything to Terrace, and the Sith would take it off our hands there. Not sure where we'll be bringing it now. Do you have any of these artifacts no, now? No, we're not due for another shipment for at least another week. Where do you take these things? Oh, I already asked that. How would, would uh, one get to these excavations exactly? It's in a valley on the surface, beyond some mountains to the east. No land route. That's why they have us fly in. Shows what you know. The academy has a route through the mountain. That's how all their students get to the excavation site. Well, regardless, the Sith don't let anybody near that valley. Even when we land, they watch us like a Dreverian hawk and want us gone quickly. So no one could sneak into the valley by ship. Not a chance. You'd be better off sneaking through the academy if you want to go to the valley. Ha! Now that'd be a sight to see. What have they been? Oh, yes, I'll be going sure now. Sure thing. Good flying, friend. Sup? I think this was the guy with the premium goods. So, special items. I'm glad you've seen the light. I'm not revving anymore. I want to stop him, but not for revenge. Yeah, what do you got for sale? Do you know a lot about the Ebon Hawks and its previous owners? Curse, what do you mean? These events have more to do with the types of owner than the Amber Hawk itself. Let me see your premium items. I forgot and I should not have bought a Meh. Not really got anything good. 
suppose I could buy a couple of these. Nothing I really want to spend the credits on. You got anything else to say? It was me, why? I didn't mean to skip past that. I didn't think he'd bring up something else. Who took care? I, look, I can look after myself. I have questions for you. Anything interesting going on here? What do you know about the Civ Academy? Anything interesting going on? I already said, I read hot. That's all for now, goodbye. Your premium items aren't too good, nothing special. The one piece of armor looked decent, but that's about it. Onward. Yeah, that guy's just bugged back there. There's nothing I can do about him. The chick who wanted to attack Cat Lady. Metal ore box thing. Why do you say metal box? Uh, why do you say metal ore? It's metal bo uh, box. Okay. Hi. <laughs> I cannot render assistance. I cannot render assistance. I wasn't trying to click Citizen. on you, asshole. They, they make their even their droids sound like assholes. What are you doing? Put you up to this. You'll get your turn soon enough, fool. And when you do, I will be there, laughing as you collapse from heat exhaustion. Please, don't hurt me. I am too weak with hunger. Yeah, that looks like the one that did not survive. Is there something specific? Are you, what's, how do you pronounce that? that? And why are you making those men stand here? That is the whole point. Personally, I think it's wonderful fun. Those fools actually think that if they stand there long enough, I'll let them become a Sith. Idiots. Sith is yeah. not a panther, all endurance and no brains. A Sith would fight for his life, no matter the odds. If these rot grubs are as stupid as they seem, then they deserve their fate. It's fair, I guess. So, isn't a real test for... So, this isn't a real test for them. Oh, it's a test, all right. It's a test to see if they're actually fool enough to die. 
If they don't, however, I certainly wouldn't admit them just for that accomplishment. You should not toy with people's lives. Oh, what a sweet guy. He should get the Sith Congeniality Medal. <laughs> mm, it is a bit boring standing out here all day, however. I think I'll go for some dinner. It will be fun to think of them while I gorge myself. They'll still be here in an hour or two, surely. I suggest you run along before I decide to make you part of the... F Persuade he is tricking you, he'll never let you into the academy. <laughs> you don't want in, buddy. Dave, Dave, just, just. Dave, leave me be. I won't listen to your manipulations. I, I will make it into the academy. Just, just a few hours long. Uh, if you're dumb enough to die, that's your own problem. Have I proved my He's tricking you, he'll never let you into the academy. Oh, no. All this for nothing. Well, he just died. There's something I could do to help you, buddy. Okay, you're just dumb. I really should hard save, shouldn't I? Oh well, too late now. And in case something bugs again, I will. Oh, I already did, that's right. You are neither a Sith, nor do you bear the medallion of a student of this facility. Please, leave at once. Hmm, I don't think I'd be... a good idea of flaunt that I'm aware of and around here that might get attention I don't want from Malik. You'll let me inside. I have been conditioned to resist mental persuasion, citizen. You need to speak to no us. Damn it. That was when I become a citizen. You sick, must man. be admitted to the academy. That decision must be made by us. The final decision However, remains with Master Yuthura. I believe she is currently at the cantina if you wish to seek her out. Now go. I wonder if there's a way to make that guy over there not die. If I had lied to him and said that he said the Sith was not for you. I didn't see her at the cantina though. I don't see that person back there. Oh, Twi'lek. Hi. Is there something you need, Jedi? Make it good for I have little patience. Are you Thurban? I am. Obviously, you have been told of me. Is it your desire, then, to train at the Academy? Do you wish to become a Sith human? Yeah, exactly. I'm here. What if I said I was already a Sith? No. Let me join you. Ah, oh, so you are just another hopeful after all. Or are you? There is something odd about you that I cannot place. Yep. Obviously, you are a Jedi. One who is very strong in the Force, it seems. So were you a part of the Order for very long? Did they train you? Not exactly. Yeah, but very little. As I thought, how interesting that they would let one with such power out of their grasp. Or are you here to spy on us? For all the good it would do. With that kind of power, you could become a great Sith. Perhaps, if I let you. Does that interest you? Yeah, Persuading why, yes. Ah, good. Exactly the sort of answer I was hoping for. I will take you to the Academy, and we shall see if you are ready to join the ranks of the Sith. Are you ready to go there now? Yes, I am. Then let us leave.
Greetings, prospective students. It appears we have a late entry. Who do you bring before me, Uthura? A young human bristling with the Force? A human that has had some training, it seems, Master Uthar. Very promising, I think. Promising? <laughs> that one's not worthy to lick spit off your shoes, Master. I met this one in the colony. Unworthy, if you ask me. That I'll judge for myself, thank you. Tell me, human, what do you know of the ways of the Sith? What preconceptions has your mind been polluted with? This is our powerful force to be reckoned with. A diplomatic answer is not the core of the matter. Our power is obvious. The question in truth goes much deeper than the surface. The Jedi equate the light with goodness and strength, and the dark with weakness and evil. That is their tradition, and it is truly no surprise that they cling to it for comfort. We, however, do not treat the Force as a burden. We treat it as a gift, a thing to be celebrated. We use it to acquire power over others. And why should we not? Because the Jedi say we should not. We are as the Force is meant to be. The Jedi would hide that from you. They would tell you the dark side is too quick, too easy. All so that they need never challenge the passions that lie within them. Joining with us means realizing your true potential. I hate you it both, not just so you know. It means not yourself solely for the sake of hidebound shamans and their antiquated notion of order. Be what you were meant to be. What say you, Lasho? Are you ready to learn the secrets of the dark side? Dare you? I dare, Master Uthar. I am ready. Brash and fiery, as expected. Turn that passion to your advantage, child. What of you, Meikle? Are you ready? I am, Master. More than ready. I sense much anger within you, young one. That is good. That will provide you power. And Shardan, what of you? I am always ready. I see. You had best gather your wits for the trial ahead, boy, or you will not last. And you, young human, does this interest you? Are you ready to learn more of what I speak? I'm ready to learn Are more. Are you? I can see into your heart, young human, and I see the dark kernel that is there. If it is ready to sprout, remains to be seen. Now then, all of you five recruits have shown a degree of facility with the Force. You all have the potential to become true Sith. Only one of you, however, will succeed. The one who succeeds will be admitted to the Academy as a full Sith. All others must wait until next year and try again, if you survive. My pupil, Uthura, shall be your teacher and master while you attempt to prove yourselves. Heed her words. As Master Uthar said, none of you are true Sith yet. For that to occur, one of you must do enough of worth, gain enough prestige to be selected. What is an act of worth? You must learn that for yourselves. Remember that you are competitors here. Fight for your destiny, or go home. If you wish to gain a lead over your competitors, the first of you to learn the code of the Sith and tell me of it will be rewarded. The rest is for you to discover. Welcome to the dark side, my children. Your one chance at true greatness lies here. I need to take a drink. One second. I thought I was done coughing when I muted that. I, th I cut it out some of that. I inhaled water. I, I, I was probably coughing for about five minutes. I think I'm good now. Uh, Dark Jedi Knight robes. I ain't gonna wear those. A 
Hey, you Thera. Ah, there you are. My favorite prospect for the year. Your favorite prospect. Absolutely. By my estimation, you are far more likely to achieve the prestige necessary to join the Sith than any of the others. As a matter of fact, I am so certain of that that I'm willing to offer you an opportunity of the once-in-a-lifetime variety. Would you like to hear it? Absolutely. Good. I do so adore someone who's willing to take a chance. As I said, you're no doubt going to be the one whom Uthar chooses to become a Sith. With my help, of course. Once that occurs, he will take you into the Valley of the Dark Lords to the tomb of Nagasado to administer the final test. There you and I will be alone with him. The perfect time to, shall we say, arrange for a change in the Academy's leadership. What's so important about this tomb? The tomb is an ancient ruin on the surface that was visited years ago by Darth Revan and Darth Malak. They discovered a star map there of great importance. Darth Malak went there? Very interesting, isn't it, Master? Reaching that map, as they did, is part of the final test. At any rate, it is not the tomb that is important. That Uthar will be alone is what is important. Wait a minute. Garth just called me Master. I never did the speech for the slaves thing. What the hell's... Did I, like, click something wrong? I remember there was, like, a speech option where... They wouldn't let these guys in. You tell them the slaves, all's good. They didn't let me do that. Huh. You want me to kill Master Uthar? Is that such a daunting prospect? No. It is I not mean, as if I'm asking you to perform the task alone. I have a feeling you have to you fight him anyway. Get nothing out of it. Master Uthar cannot prevail against us both. That's all there is to it. It is a very simple matter. I mean, we're probably gonna have to fight anyway. I have no problem with teaming up with you. Sure. People against masters sounds familiar. And so it should. It is central to our beliefs. It is my responsibility to replace my master when I am strong enough. <laughs> I just heard a scream in the background. Very well, I agree. I'm so glad you see it my way. I will begin to make preparations for your final test. Your only worry now is to get there. Don't disappoint me. How do I get more prestige? You must impress Master Uthar. Go to him with news of your deeds or artifacts you have discovered. The first and easiest way would be for you to learn the code of the Sith and speak it to him. I can teach you that if you like. Shall I go on? Can you tell me the Sith Code? I can help you understand it. Would you like to hear it? Peace is a lie. There is only passion. Through passion, I gain strength. Through strength, I gain power. power. Through power, power I, gain I gain victory. victory. Through Your victory, victory, my chains, chains are, are broken. broken. The Force, the force shall, shall free set me free. Me. Simple words, yet easily misunderstood. Would you care for me to explain anything? Peace is a lie, there is only passion. The Jedi would have you believe that peace is a desirable goal. That peace of the spirit is the way the Force is mastered. That a lack of conflict betters man. We know different. It is our passion, our hate, and our desire that fuels the Force. It is conflict that improves the lot of civilization and single being both. Conflict forces one to better oneself. It forces change, growth, adaption, evolution, or death. These are not our laws, but the universe's. Without conflict, you have only stagnation. That's actually fair enough, I guess. Passion against what strength. What fuels your power with the Force but your passion? The stronger, darker emotions. Anger, hatred, fear. These passions empower us. What about love? Love is more dangerous than all those things. Love leads to anger and hatred more often than not, but it also leads to mercy, which is far worse. That, however, is a lesson for another time. I mean, I still think your emotions can be a good thing depending on how you use them. I 
see. It is our goal to be stronger, to achieve our potential and not rest upon our laurels. We are the Seekers, not the Shepherds. I think I asked these two. Through power, I gained victory. How many sorts of victories can you imagine? A Peaceful lot. Victory. victory by sacrifice, a truce, an achievement. Unless the victory is achieved by demonstrating that your power is superior, it is only an illusion, temporary at best. Eh. We seek more. Through strength, I gain power. The stronger you become in the Force, the more power you will achieve. But always must you fight for your power. Without strife, your victory has no meaning. Without strife, you do not advance. Without strife, there is only stagnation. Through victory, my chains are broken. This has been argued over, and often. The chains represent our restrictions, both those placed upon us and those we place upon ourselves. Ultimately, the goal of any Sith is to free herself from such restrictions. In a way, it is so we may do whatever we wish, but it is much more than that. One who has freed themselves from all restrictions has reached perfection, their potential fulfilled. Perfect strength, perfect power, perfect destiny. Imagine it. That is our ideal, at any rate. It is said in Sith legend that the Sithari, the perfect being, will one day lead us. But perhaps that is just a legend. You don't think the Sithari can I exist? I wonder what that being would be like. The legends say the Wasn't Sithari that, uh... would destroy us and make us stronger What's than Darth, ever. But Darth perhaps Bane? it is just a legend. Perfection is a goal, I think, rather than a state of being. The Jedi would argue that, no doubt. I think it was Darth Bane. I can't remember which one was considered to be the Sithari. The Force shall set me free. The Force is our servant and our master. Our teacher and our companion. A weapon and a tool. Know it, and you know the universe. Master it, and you master the universe. Strive for perfection, and the Force shall reward you. I think I got I'm it. I'm not surprised. The Force is strong with you. Master it, and it shall serve you well. What do you know about the these ruins on the surface? I have been involved in the work there over the last couple of years, but not often. Most of the excavating is left to the students. What did you wish to know? Is there way to say way inside the tomb? Not unless you are accompanied by Master Uthar. No, it is strictly forbidden. And I truly doubt you could bypass the doors to the tomb with anything less than ship blasters. Even then, perhaps. Is there other way inside? None. I do not even know how Master Uthar gains entrance, to tell the truth. Though I look forward to discovering that fact. I have searched many times, so do not bother. There is no other way. Do not fret, however. Simply get the prestige you need, and you will see the tomb soon enough. Why are they interested in these we ruins? We could learn much about the history of the ancient Sith. Why they were on Korriban, and why they left. Perhaps we could learn more about the origin of the Force itself. With that knowledge could come great power. I've heard enough. You, you know anything about Darth Revan? Revan? You mean Darth Malak's former master? That's the one? Very little. I never met him personally, though I heard he was a very powerful man. Very charismatic. In the end, Revan was outshone by his pupil. Such is the way of the Sith. Why? Is this dead man of importance to you? I don't want to mention this door. You think, uh, might as well, you think it's possible he might be alive? Anything is possible. Uthar's former master still lives, though he is in no condition to challenge his former pupil for leadership. Perhaps the same is true for Revan. Perhaps Revan is out there, somewhere, waiting to take revenge upon Malak. More likely, what we were told is the truth. Revan is dead. Malik would be foolish to leave his old master alive, considering all the knowledge Revan held. So you wouldn't recognize Revan if you two had met? Is there any reason I should? Beside the fact I did not know Revan in life, Revan was known for wearing a full helmet and cape. Perhaps Revan's body had been disfigured by the power of the Force. 
It is not unheard of. Regardless, I doubt I shall be meeting Revan anytime soon. I she came here before. Both Revan and Malik came to Korriban when they discovered the tomb of Nagasato. That was before my time. That's all I have to ask. Tell me about yourself. About myself. I am originally from Slaheron, if you must know. I was a slave to a cruel master, Omish the Hut. I'm sure you don't need to know more. Oh, I like to pry into other people's business, so yes, there's more I want to know. Though I can't. You have had an excellent start. Go, gain more prestige. Mind if I steal your stuff? Yes, you do, because I can't steal your stuff. I should probably go do that first before I go exploring. Uh... Yeah, it should probably be my first priority before I try to. Uh, yeah, I figured that'd be locked. I don't know if I'm on a time limit for this. How the hell do I get there? This way? No, this way. Uthar. Greetings, young one. You have much to do yet. You have gained little prestige. You will have to work quickly if you hope to best the others. How do I get more aside from telling no, you the code? It is no more complicated than I said. Perform impressive deeds or bring me a suitably valuable artifact from the Valley of the Dark Lords. Oh, so it's a popularity contest, basically. Wonderful. Really, however, you should seek out Uthura and get her advice. She is your trainer, after all. Uh... I know this is the code. Then finish the code as I speak it. Peace is a lie. That is only... Passion. Through passion, I gain... Strength. Through strength, I gain... Power. Through power, I gain... Uh, what was that? Victory. Through victory. Victory. Ah, oh, shit. My chains are broken. The force shall free me. Yes, good. You have indeed learned the code of the Sith. Speaking the words and knowing the words are, however, two different things. Tell me then, true or false, victory by any means is desirable. Yes. False. Unless victory Wait, proves what? your superiority, it is an illusion. Oh. It is, sadly, it seems you did not. Damn it. Indi Greetings. Then finish the piece. Oh, I can do it again. Okay. Peace is. Passion. Through pack. Strength. Through st power. Through power, I gain. Victory. Through victory. My chains are broken. The false. Yes. Tell me then. False. Well done. I will test you no more. You know the code. Very impressive. Go now. You have done well, but you have not impressed me enough to declare you the victor. I have matters to attend to. How do I gain prestige? No, it is no more complicated than I said. I already asked, so let oh, me so skip. So it's a popularity contest. Really, however, you should seek out Euthura and get... Where is the valley? There is an exit that leads to the surface of the planet. The valley is only a short trip from there. It is not difficult to find. I don't want to know more about you. No, I'm not going to tell her about you the betrayal. To about I'm not going to tell him about the betrayal. And why would I indulge your idle curiosity? Will Sorry if I'm a little friends, sniffly. You think? I strived many years to hone my power, until I was able to drive out my predecessor and rule the Academy. If you are smart, you will aim to do the same, or better. There is nothing else you need to know. Do not ask again, young one. Goodbye. Very well. Back to my quarters, I guess.
So I, I can start there and explore this whole place before I head out there. I gotta find, uh, Karth's son, was it? Okay, so that's my place. That's her. What's this way? Oh, wait a minute, I got turned around. Shit. Let's see. Okay, that's the... Oh, uh, hello. I don't remember seeing you here before. My name is Kel. Kel Alguin. Is something wrong? I... Oh, uh, nothing. Are you sure? Uh, yes. My master always says I'm too trusting. Too willing to show weakness. You're a Sith, so I, I really shouldn't... I'm not a Sith yet. Oh, I know that. I mean, you aren't yet, but you intend to be. I mean, you're just like everyone else here. I'm not. And you're well, not. I, 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 I didn't mean it like that. Well, how did you mean it, then? I, I shouldn't trust you. Sure you can. I just don't feel I belong here. I thought maybe I did at first, but now... I don't know... I just have so many doubts. Yeah, if it doesn't feel like, then perhaps you don't belong but here. But where would I go then? What would I do? Can't wait for that guy to pass. It doesn't matter. Have you consider the dark side just isn't your way? Uh, yeah, maybe you're right. Uh, I'll go and tell Master Uthar that I'm not ready for this. Maybe it won't be so bad. Uh, I thank, think you should you. maybe just try to bail without saying anything. You, you might be getting yourself killed, buddy. Yes? Uh, Come Karth, on. you have the security skill, right? You can hack stuff? I can't remember. On it. Down. Oh, loud. That probably shouldn't just be blasting away. What is it? You could probably dash better. What? Damn it, Karth, move. Sure. That goes for me too. What is it? Can you hack it? Oh. Okay. Can you steal his stuff? Nope. Uh huh. Sure. <laughs> Let's start from over here. Woohoo! If it isn't the freak from the colony. Hello, freak. Nerf herder. What is a nerf herder? Who are you? Chardin's the name. Don't forget it. You'll have me to thank when you get kicked out of here. You want to make an issue out of it? And go into the dueling room? <laughs> I've got better things to do than give you a fair fight. You can count on seeing me later, though. My lightsaber has your name on it. Okay, so no talking to you into the light side. You? I remember you from the colony. I can't believe you actually made it into the academy. Who are you? My name is Lasho. Remember it, for I'll be the one who earns the prestige to move on. You'll have to be satisfied with next year, I suppose. I wonder if I use the force to smack her to the ground and slide her all over the place and humiliate her like, uh... That one guy did to the uh, dude on the bridge, and I can't care to remember the new guy's names. The newest set of movies was just awful. I think. 
want to say it was Snoke or something on the bridge of their ship. Like, smacked one of the guys on the bridge to the ground, started sliding him around. Do that to her in front of everybody. wonder if that'd get me prestige. You're trying to become a Sith as well? Just figure that out, did you? <laughs> it just so happens that I have a surefire way of pulling ahead in this little contest of ours. You don't really have a chance. What are, you what are you on about? I found an artifact that will impress Uthar far more than anything you could ever scrounge up. I'll win for sure. Why haven't you bought Uthar I don't yet? have it just yet. I'll get it when I'm good and ready. You know, where is this artifact? It's guarded, isn't it? So what if it is? I'll get it eventually, regardless. Nothing good comes without a bit of a fight. That's the Sith motto. Maybe I could help you get it. Help me get it? I don't know. Hmm. I suppose I could use some help. The artifact I know of certainly won't be easy to take. But why should I work with you? Flattery, is it? I had to. I suppose it's possible that Master Uthar could award tell both of us prestige. We'd be ahead of the I others, have no plans sure. here. I'll stab her in the back first the chance I get. Lies in the gullet of a Tukata mother. I can arrange for us to meet her, but you're going to have to help me in putting her down. That makes sense to you? Go into the valley when you're prepared enough. I'll be amongst the central pillars near the north end. Why is this holocron so important? Because it probably contains secrets from the time when the Sith ruins on this planet first existed. You don't think that Master Uthar would find that impressive? I'm just supposed to trust and you. And I'm just supposed to trust you. Fair You're enough. The one who has to work. You watch me, and I'll watch you. I don't trust you any more than you trust me. If you don't like that, don't come. What is a holocron? A holocron. This holocron, anyway, is an ancient recording device. It can store and display large amounts of information. See you there. Remember, the central pillar's in the valley. I'll be waiting, so don't take too long. Oh, I'll take my sweet-ass time. Can I steal your shit? Nope. You're gonna be waiting for me a minute. Hello. It's a bad year to try and become a Sith, you know. I've got it all wrapped up. I remember you, or Mikkel, right? That's right. You might as well just go home, you know. There can only be one Sith this year, and that's me. What makes you so sure? You think I would tell you? Have my brain started dribbling out of my nose or something? Yes. You can at least give me a hint. Hmm. I guess there's no harm in it. Word has it that Master Uthar gives big points for Sith artifacts that are brought back from the valley. The valley? The valley of the Sith Lords. You know, where the Academy does all its excavating. I just like to hear people talk. If you really don't know, just go out the east exit and you'll see. Oh, hey, it's Dustal. Karth, I found your son. You take a wrong turn somewhere? Dustal, is that you? Oh, lovely. It's father. Figures you'd show up after all this time. How did you manage to get inside the academy? Through the front doors. Cute. I wonder how interested Master Uthar would be to know just who he has in his whip. Unless you've switched sides, Father, but I doubt that. Just why are you here, Father? Not for me, I hope. Couldn't you have gotten yourself blown up on some ship and spared us this reunion? Dustal, what, what are you talking about? I, I thought you were dead. Too bad you didn't still think that. Or did you really think I'd be happy to see you? 
Look, everyone, it's Father. Come to rescue me at long last. Sure, he may have left Mother and I to die on Telos, but that doesn't matter. No, I didn't abandon you. The task force just arrived too late. Telos was in ruins, and your mother... I, mean, I held her while... Well, I looked for you. I swear I looked everywhere. Ah, oh, save it. You abandoned us long before. We were alone all during the wars, and even once you came back, you still didn't stay. I didn't have a choice. I was needed at... Yeah? Well, you were needed at home, too. You were needed when the bombing started, and I got captured. You know what? It doesn't matter. Not anymore. I have a new family now. A family that cares about me. I don't need... Oh, they'll throw the your ass. You can't oh, what? The you're, they'll Sith throw your life mother. away. The destroyed Telos. So? You're the soldier, father. How many mothers have you killed? No, you've been brainwashed. The son I knew would never... You never knew me. You weren't even there to know me. So don't presume to tell me what I would or wouldn't do. I don't know what's been done to you, but you are coming with me out of here now. Touch me, old man, and I'll kill you. Get out! Get out of here before I tell the Sith that you're here! Dude, I'm pretty sure they'll throw your life away far quicker than the Republic will. Calm down, Gustav. Karth is only trying to protect you. Yeah, Karth is only trying to protect you. I don't you. need his protection, not anymore. The Sith give me everything I need. You can't mean that. The Sith are... They're evil. They're the dark side. They they took me away from you and your mother. They're, they're what took you from me. No, they are not evil. They're not. The dark side is superior. And you, you were at war long before they came along. The Sith war to conquer, to rule the helpless. I went to war for you, Dustal. For your freedom, your future. <laughs> I don't believe you. If I failed you, son, then it's... It's my failure. Please don't add to it by becoming part of something evil. Prove it. Prove that the Sith are so evil, and I'll... I'll think about it. Come with us, then we'll show you. I'm not gonna follow you around. Forget it. If you're caught, they'll just think I was betraying them. I'll stay right here. I won't tell anyone you're here. For now, you find some proof, and you bring it to me. If I hear you asking questions about me, or doing a single thing to jeopardize my position in the Sith, I swear I'll tell everyone what you're up to. You got that, Father? You prove what you're saying is true. I'm not going anywhere otherwise. I got it, Dustal. I'll be back. I swear it. I didn't mean to click that. I should have brought mission instead of uh, cat lady. She's got security and can break into shit. I probably might. That could be useful at some point, I bet. I don't think anybody here has a high security skill. Can't go through there. What is through here, I wonder? I can't hear you over the two shitheads fighting with lightsabers next to us. Who might you be? I am a trainer here at the Academy. I think I may be able to offer you some Yes, can you help me? No, I don't know what you're talking about. Let me tell you what I can. A group of students were ordered to perform executions on civilians within the colony. They refused to carry out the order. Well, they can be useful for Duster. Master Duster. Uthar naturally ordered them killed, but they fled before this could be. If one could carry out Uthar's order, it would be worth considerable. There are five of them, if I remember. And they cannot be uh, if they have not met the chief planet. I am hiding in the hills of the surface, 
Oh, you mean like outside the academy where I just came from, or? You aren't even a full Sith. Don't bother me. <laughs> Another hopeful wandering about the academy. <sighs> I suppose you want to know how to get prestige. Who might you be? I'm one of the academy trainers, of course. You'd do well to watch your tone with me, hopeful. I'll be one of your instructors when and if you reach your final test. Final test. Oh, yes. You gather prestige to earn the opportunity to take the final test. You don't automatically become a student. <laughs> You'll see. How do I know I have that much prestige? <laughs> As if I didn't have better things to do. Has anyone told you about Jorak Um? No, who's Jorak? Well, the first thing you should know is that it's not a name you should mention around Master Uthar if you can avoid it. Jorak Un was once Uthar's master, you see, and the head of this academy. He went a little insane, however, and Uthar forced him to flee to the surface and hide. It seems that Jorak has been spending his time kidnapping students who wander into the Valley of the Dark Lords. No idea why. I've also no idea why Uthar doesn't do something about it. If you want prestige, however, you'll find that hermit, as everyone calls him. You'll find Jorak and either kill him or bring back anything he's been writing. Uthar would like that. Now be gone. I have better things to do than chat with lost hopefuls. Yep, I'm just trying to gather information. I already know what I'm supposed to be doing, teacher. The hell's with your Why are you not speaking English? But you're here, you're here, you speak Twi'lek. Ah, okay. Okay, well, now I get to this valley. I'm well there. What are they? Manaman Atota Haki Jukrata Bola Shui Chongatong Chongkin no Bunka Mulera Kunkile Kunkile no Ba What in the Chuk Mulera Can tell me about the valley. This to Bunko Kokima Sanka. Sing Palachiska Mule, Tunarana, Nu Prata, Dunko Sicha, Duma, Wamama Tux, Keva Toma. Nisha, Julorcha, King Kuno, Bule, Rata, Kumjus, Tachmiki, Grabble Mogo, Kachichu, Chan Shak Bulara, Umra Chiska, Jedaba, the one and Nidibobo, Tong Nabunsha. Anything I should watch for? What are these, uh, whatever, how you say that? I'll be going now. You got anything to say? Another hopeful wandering about the academy. <sighs> I suppose you want to know how to get prestige. Who might you be? I'm one of the academy trainers, of course. You'd do well to watch your tone with me, Final test. Oh yes. You oh, so you're just a clone of the other the woman. Opportunity to take the final test. You don't automatically become a student. <laughs> You'll see. Where are we going now? You? Another one. 
Okay, another Twi'lek speaker. So you aren't Sif? Yeah, you don't speak your like a basic. Pograshi on the Uncomba, Chin Tondo Mochuba, Loda Dita Kun, Ida Patisa Batua, Kacha Tutung, Pograsha Kun Tijaka Um, Chubakaha, Chopa, Chawachuish, Yunku, Jodo, Jid Bungarantang, Tong Haitwam, Jiji Jum Lumpa, Nita Poe Tikitu, Dolfa da Bongwaleo, Gandona Chuchut, Kachi Chu Ita Dundonga. You malita kuto tun. Jila mula ne ni tolpa da pangwale kando nang gugu chut chut. Kava du. Have to go now. You're useless. Any goodies for me? Y'all just chill with me breaking into stuff. to the valley. Okay, I'm not done exploring yet. Map. Okay, so what's up here then? Like someone's having fun. Ah, maybe you can do better than I. This Mandalorian is proving more resistant than I expected. What are you trying to do? I'm trying to get him to tell us where his weapon cache is hidden. So far, all the serum combinations I'm using are proving ineffective. If I bring his drug threshold too high, he'll go into shock and be useless. Too low, and he just refuses to talk. It's been maddening. You want me to try it? Certainly. Uh, just don't kill him or send him into shock. He's supposed to be questioned, not executed. If you manage to get the location of his cash out of him, I'll be sure to pass on the good word to Master Hilfa. Okay, I'm gonna torture people here. Who's got the best security system so I can hack it, though? If that's a thing I can do. Can you speak classic basic? Tell me I'll help you if I can. Runda di hotonga kun hunka me. Wanna kun bez ching palamule tonkin ka chi kun ida hodonga e king kuno ba mule ra chiku. This could get me in trouble, but I'll do it. Skill. Damn it. Um, I made an error. How the hell do I check what my party can do?
There we go, I think. Okay, defense, strength, constitution, intelligence. That's uh, there it is. So embarrassingly, I'm the best one for the job. Is there anything I can do to improve this? Oh, there we go. Up, oh, I can't help you, buddy. Your wish? Uh -huh. Sure. Amplifier. Where's my thing? There we go. May I'll come back to you later, maybe. Yeah. Eh, maybe next time. Well, that is all the time I have for this episode, YouTube. I hope I can go back and get mission. This was a mistake. Bringing, I should have kept mission or someone with a high security computer use. I'll see y'all next time. Later, everybody.